Good morning everybody. I am Mohammed Bahij Al Barra from Kenya Center College for the Science Research Project Competition. Topic of my research is problems associated with sand mining in Upar Delta region of Kenya. The place I have selected to carry out my research is Upar Delta region which is found in Chinkomalai district. We know the lowest river of Sri Lanka, Mahavali river ends in Chinkomalai district. One of the ending place is Upar Delta region. Basically, at the mouth of the river, sands and minerals are collected. So, as the sands are collected, a continuous sand mining is being carried out from 2008 in Upar Delta region. By continuous and heavy sand mining, many problems arise around that area. Social problems, economic problems, environmental problems arise in that area. So, the aim of the research is identifying the problems related to the sand mining and making suggestions to minimize those problems. Hypothesis of my research is sand mining affects the natural geology of the delta region. Now we can move to the methodology part. I have used two methodologies. First one is the qualitative one and the second one is the quantitative one. In my qualitative methodology, I have used the paper survey method with open-ended question and analyze those data by SPSS. Then from the quantitative one, that is the important part of my research, I will use modern technology, Google Earth Pro. In Google Earth Pro, using the Ed Path option, I have drawn the edges for a particular island in Upar Delta region. Then for the area analysis, I will use the polygon tool method. Now come to the results. These are the results from paper survey method. Uh, here we can see that stock breeding of marine lives in Upar Delta region is severely affected by sand mining and cultivation, habitat, animal husbandry, drinking water are not much affected by sand mining. And this is the results from Google Earth Pro. I have taken two areas from two different time periods. In 2008, area of this region was 4,786 square feet meters but uh, this is the same area in 2022 the area was 3,542 square feet meters so we can see that 1,244 square feet are lost by the same mining of that particular island in Kopara Delta region so we can see that uh, if the mining continues for a long term period, it will be surely affected. Yeah. Now we can come to the conclusion. Stock breeding of marine lives and geological structure of Upara Delta region is severely affected by the mining. So to control those effects, making awareness among the people around that area and uh, controlling the illegal mining helps us to save the Upar Delta region and save the Upar people. Thank you very much.